Welcome to T-Hub. Welcome to uh, IFDI Tour Auto. The Innovate for Digital India Challenge and the overall idea of Digital India is certainly something that's extremely impressive. The best way of pulling out the best idea is to have as many ideas as you can. Talk to each other, there's young minds come together. Innovate for Digital India Challenge 2.0 is a market program. Helping the startups solving the uh, local problems of Indian citizens and the fostering uh, you know, innovation. From a technology perspective, we learned a lot from Intel team in terms of the available ecosystem. One thing I, I can share right now is the first comment that my team member made is this is an energetic and vibrant atmosphere. So because of this program, we get connected to different teams in Intel and then because of their support, we could make the device. You could tell right away you know, that whoever did the selection did a good job. I know that there was a, a lot of applications and it, it's clear that the best of the best were picked. We actually got a clear idea of, you know, how the international market works, what the Silicon Valley is all about, how, how things are different from the Indian market on a global market. We got selected in IFDI 2.0 and uh, the development, all the development that we did for this particular event is helping us a lot in our business also and the product development, the product that we have developed for this particular event. IFDI gave us an opportunity to work with some of the best Indian entrepreneurs. I would actually say dreams need people to make them into a reality. How to really show success? It's not about innovating for the sake of it. I think that's where the entire program was really designed for. Going forward, out of top 10, three will be selected and they will be sent to Silicon Valley for a market access program in Silicon Valley for two weeks. And they will come back and they compete for their uh, final position to uh, win the award. I am at T-Hub Hyderabad today. I'm really excited to be here because we are announcing the winners for Innovate for Digital India Challenge 2.0. We selected the best entrepreneurs from the world. Uh, we announced and presented today on the stage. It will be a great moment. There's so much of innovation which is happening in the digital space that uh, it was important for us to recognize these people and to make use of these innovations in the everyday life. I believe the heterogeneous uh, combination of startups gave us an opportunity to learn from each other a lot. You know, you could say belief in what we're trying to achieve and what we're trying to do. Now time to announce the winner. Can we have the Banyan Nation team on stage? A platform that allows municipalities to look at waste management from a bird's eye view, where cities can look at the attendance, the waste flows, and the waste that is ending up in the landfills, and how it fits in with Prime Minister Modi's theme of Swachh Bharat and Digital India. By interacting with folks at TCS and Intel, we were able to develop the platform from just being a production beta into a full-fledged uh, product. We love T-Hub. I wish I worked from here. T-Hub was much more like our home. Today is a great example of how computing and technology 
can be used by startups like Banyan Nation, which is oriented itself towards providing sustainable waste management solution in line with government's Digital India and Smart City objectives. I want to thank T-Hub, Intel DSD for giving GBI this fabulous opportunity to work with 10 Indian startups. Once again, my congratulations to uh, everyone who have so successfully organized uh, this year's challenge. The beauty of this program is that we sourced 10 rock star entrepreneurs who are solving real problems that India as a country faces. We are very, very happy and proud. So kudos to all the winners. Good luck to the, uh, the top 10 as their journey towards entrepreneurship continues. We want to remain focused on bringing more programs like this to the Indian uh, startup ecosystem.